Uh, hi everyone, now we will do example about parallel and perpendicular vectors uh, in the coordinate system in position vector form. So we have the two ideas. If they are perpendicular, if perpendicular u, we, the dot product of the vectors should be equal to zero. If they are parallel, we, the ratios must be same, must be same. So y1 over x1 should be equal to y2 over x2. Anyway, let's start with this. The dot product rule, you need to remember, the dot product rule, you multiply the x numbers by each other, which is x times six, and then plus, you multiply the y values by each other, y parts by each other, which is two times, in parentheses, x minus four. The dot product should be equal to zero. There will be six x in here, plus two x and minus eight, two times x, two times minus four equals zero. Move minus eight in here, and six plus two, eight x. So x equals one. So the ratios, uh, the y1, x1 from the first vector, 2 over x, should be equal to from the second vector, x minus 4 over 6. So 2 times 6 is 12. x times x, x squared, x times minus 4, minus x. You leave 0 in here, x squared minus 4x, and 12, move to other side minus 12, it's a quadratic one, so we need to factorize it. Three times four, but they have the difference one. So two times six, they have the different difference four, so they are the numbers. So the minus goes to big number always, the middle place sign goes to big number always, then the other number turns into plus two. Let's recheck them, plus two minus six, they confirm the middle part, so you can factorize it as x plus two, x minus six. There you can get two answers, x plus two equals zero, x equals minus two, and x minus six equals zero when x equals six itself. So we have all the answers.